Hey everyone, this tip is for Office 365 admins. I'm going to show you how to create a service ticket with Microsoft. Now, the example scenario I have for this service ticket is that I was doing a cutover migration this weekend and 10 mailboxes in my domain kept failing. So I couldn't fix it, I need to open up a support case with Microsoft. So what I'll do is from the admin center, I'll go to support, click overview, and it was a problem with mail, so I'll click mail. So now I've got to fill out my service request. So feature, I was working on migration, so I'll click migration. And what happened? Cut over migration failed or is slow to complete. Now you'll want to sum up your issue in one sentence and then give some more details. So similar to other service tickets you might have filled out before. I'm just creating an example scenario, so I'm going to fill out test. Now be sure to thoroughly answer this. If you're doing it in real life, give a thorough explanation of what's going on. Now there's some suggestions that they pre-populate here for me to look at. So if I click on one of these, I can go through and read a community post. So I would encourage you all just for the purposes of self-service, check out some of these. You might have found them already. And in that case, you'll just go to yes, continue. You do still need to create a service request. Now they're going to ask you for some more details depending on the scenario, so I'm still testing, so I'll just go through and give some answers here. Click next, and then at this point I have the option to confirm all my details and submit my ticket. They'll also ask you for a phone number and your email address is populated there so that they can get in touch with you. So if you've got a scenario like I do where you need some extra help, you haven't been able to find your answer online at all, you'll submit the ticket and Microsoft will get in touch with you. Hope this tip helped. Please check back for more tips and tricks. Thanks.